It's night two of the closure of 168th from Dodge to Maple, a huge project that affects a lot of drivers in West Omaha. Alternate routes were packed again during the evening commute. Good evening, I'm Craig DeGrelli. And I'm Jennifer Griswold. Many who live in the area say it's a headache, but also understand it's the price of progress. Reporter Nick Starling joins us now with the frustrations. Nick? Well, Jen Craig, this project will widen 168th Street to four lanes to keep up with heavier traffic as more people move to West Omaha. But those who live or work in that area will have to deal with this for quite a while. It's bumper to bumper traffic along 192nd Street as frustrations boil over. Not just for the commuters stuck in the bottlenecks, but also those who live on the alternative routes. It's kind of a little bit of a mess. Tara Maynard Opertens lives in the Fair Meadows neighborhood where 192nd and Blondo intersect. It's a little bit of a headache. Um, the intersection was um, not great to begin begin with. Um, it's kind of one of those things where you sit here and you just uh, sometimes you, you watch and see all the chances people take because it is so busy. About three times as busy than she's used to, which in turn makes her keep a watchful eye on her 18 month old Colton. We kind of feel like we can't let him go too far because people just yeah gun it up and down the street. Others in the neighborhood like Darren Inspar feel the traffic pain. It stinks. It's it really is not convenient for a lot of us out here. His drive to I-80 yesterday was anything but quick. It took me 28 minutes just to get out of here. The detour also slowed Kim Miller's drive to and from work. In good traffic days, I can get there probably 10 minutes, um, 15 at the most, and it took me about 25 this morning. So it's definitely adding on to my commute time. Time. Many hope will eventually pay off in the end. As we all have to deal with the bumps, we all just find ways to get around it. Just got to remember, it's probably going to be worth it in the end when we have nice roads without potholes and, you know, smooth traffic, but it's going to be a long time. Now, soon as stop signs on 102nd and Blonda will be replaced by traffic lights to help with congestion. The 168th winding project is slated to last nine months, so hopefully when it's finished, it'll be a great Christmas gift for commuters in December. Point Live in studio, Nick Starling, 3 News Now. All right.